morning, friends. We are giving you um, an avocado toast upgrade. Everyone loves, I feel like we all love the avocado toast right? here in Southern California. Yeah, yeah. But like you use the word zhuzh. We're going to zhuzh them We're up. We're zhuzhing it up this morning. <laughs> so our friend Debbie Korberg is here Hello. to spice things up for us. We're going to spice it up. Okay, look at what she's brought here today. I thought, Wow, we're talking about avocado toast, but there are so many colors, so many fragrances, and I'm just like, this is beautiful. Thank you. What do we have? So, we have avocado toast. Uh huh. Um, you could call it a s salad on toast. Like a breakfast salad? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, a okay. breakfast salad, okay. exactly. <laughs> because, truthfully, it's a whole bunch of delicious vegetables, mm -hmm. avocado included, though technically a fruit. Right. <laughs> yes, yes, okay. Um, and an egg. So, you know, we're just kind of changing it up. A lot of times you go to restaurants and you get these kind of fancy avocado toast breakfasts. Literally, fancy. Fancy. Yes. Yeah, so we're doing fancy avocado toast. And you can do it at home. Yeah, it, not when you're like on the run to eat, but if you have a little time in the morning, mm -hmm. you don't want to be eating this in the car. <laughs> it would be a hot <laughs> right, mess. Right. <laughs> and the first thing I noticed, I have to be honest, I'm like, your bread, I mean, this is like, you. you this is like two servings for me. Oh, because yeah. Because it's just large. Yeah, it's a sourdough. Oh, I love so, sourdough. I mean, first thing is you need a really good hearty bread, whether yes. it's sourdough or a country. Mm -hmm. uh, we all love Prager's here in San Diego. That's yes. a great one. Uh, but, you know, if you want to elevate your avocado toast, mm -hmm. maybe you're thinking about summertime brunch and having some people over. Yes. This is a really fun way to do it. Nothing wrong with bagels and locks and pancakes and sure. waffles. Sure. All good. Yes. But in summertime, this is kind of fun and a change. I did this for a wedding shower where we did an avocado toast bar. Bar. Ah. So it's like a build your own. Yes. Yeah, so smart. So. Why not? First thing I did is I took some sourdough, I put it in the pan with some olive oil, and I okay. toasted it up. All right. Of course, you need good avocados. Make sure they're ripe. Yes. So. And here's here's my question before we even continue. Yeah. How do we make sure that it stays? I want to say healthy, because I feel like it, it just it gets. What 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 word am I looking for? It just gets overripe like oh, so quickly. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. So um, the avocados when you. You know, get them from the supermarket. Obviously, uh -huh. you want to check if they're hard as a rock. Okay. Get them, but they're going to sit out for a few days. Okay. Don't put them in the fridge. They need to ripen outside. Got it. Um, sometimes when I'm in a mad hurry and I couldn't find them, I'll put them in a brown bag and put them outside in the sun. Oh. And that helps soften and bring them more ripe. Oh, I see. Okay, good. But what do you do when you have leftover avocado and you don't want it to go bad because it goes yes, bad like, like that. that? So I always leave the pit in. Oh, leave the pit in. And I wrap it super tight with cellophane okay. plastic wrap. Okay. Um, and then and, I can put it in the fridge? And then you can put okay. it in the fridge. Absolutely. You want to make sure it stays in the fridge because you it. don't want to leave that out. Okay. So you got your avocado. Yes. And then we can have fun zhuzhing it up. So. Oh. Zhuzh is my word. I like the word <laughs> zhuzh. So okay. do you want to make a little something for breakfast. Why don't we I mean do I know it? it's National Donut Day and everything. We did the donuts. It's called Balance Deb. Okay. It's called Balance. Okay, so what are we doing? So I took the liberty of putting some avocado Perfect. already on. Uh -huh. And we have arugula if you're a fan of that. Mm -mm, no. Okay. I think I'm gonna pass on the arugula. How do you feel about cucumbers? Let's do it. Okay. <laughs> you can do it. I didn't want you to if you want. I can use my hands. You can That's use okay. your hands. Then we're, well, I'm going to make it. And we know the sap is going to be coming in afterwards. Yes. Yeah, so like, I'm going to go get started. I like yeah. the cucumbers. Okay. Well, how do you like your yours? Like that one. <laughs> well, I noticed that it's got beets in it. I know. Yeah. Why did I never think to put beets in it? Are you a roasted beet person? Mm. Ish. Mm. How do you feel about pickled radishes? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, so we got some of those here. All I did was put, um, I sliced some radishes and we'll talk about how I got them so beautiful. Okay. And some white wine vinegar and salt. I, I didn't even think of white wine vinegar. Yeah, so you can easily get that at the supermarket. So these, these are pistachios that I'm putting on, right? Yeah, do you oh. like goat cheese? Mm, I like feta. Oh, I didn't bring that. It's okay, okay Debbie, you next know time, what? Next I, time, I'm, Am I picky? I guess I am, oh my yes. goodness. So we've got pistachios, pumpkin seeds, <gasps> the piece de resistance, are you a white? Balsamic. Yes, yes, so let's do it. this is an 18 year age. It's over. That's all right, have fun. <laughs> she said, have fun. Put a little bit of that on. Mm -hmm. That just brightens up the whole dish and the strawberries Ooh, and the white balsamic. Here we go. And a little bit of olive oil, the galili, the premium stuff, and of course the avocado toast topper, because 
That's what it's called. Okay. Alongside. And what is it? What, it's what do paprika, we have? sumac, sesame seeds, Ooh. salt. And just go ahead and finish it. And I know you like your eggs well done. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I did them both ways just in case. Well, thank you, Debbie. Yeah, so there you Look go. at that Enjoy beautiful. Nice oh, breakfast. there you go. I've got my breakfast salad ready for me here. Uh, breakfast, uh, breakfast salad, uh, avocado toast bar. I love this idea. Here's the thing. If you want more of Debbie's tips, you can always go to our website, fox5sandigo.com. Click the scene on tab and we'll get you hooked up with all her spices. And there's too. a recipe for this too. Yes, the recipes. Okay. Yeah. We're going to go to break. How am I going to do this and then go back on the desk? Uh, this is a fork and knife situation, but go it for is. it. It is. It's dripping all over. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. Mmm. Give me back. <laughs> <laughs> 